Hey, this is Chad from Zombie Fight Shark. Welcome to episode two, part one of Too Many Plugins. This one is going to be about the Viking synthesizer from Blamsoft. And let's listen to a short work done with only the Viking, and then we'll talk about how to use it. Enjoy. The work you heard, uh, everything was done with Viking. And um, let's figure out how to make a drum kit really quickly using Viking. So here's the default sound. Basic sine wave. And we are gonna do a few simple things and make a kick. So let's make a kick. Um, first, we can adjust this. See, here's your volume. Adjust sustain and then adjust release and adjust decay and you're halfway to an 808 right there now if you, now you can really get as creative as you want after this um, once you've done you've adjusted the decay and the release then you know just find what sounds good to you I'm going to turn on some noise because I like to add some color. Helps with the body. Um, we got white noise. We got pink noise. And we got classic. And then you can mess with your cutoff there on your filter. All right. So I like that. Let's try doing something with it. All right, so it's even easier to make a snare. You're gonna turn off the oscillator and then turn on the noise oscillator. And then you can hear we're you know, constant. We're gonna turn the sustain off. Now it's just a click. And then you're going to adjust your decay and release to your taste. You can play with your resonance and your filters and your cutoff and all that good stuff, but you know, this just little little noise hit, you're you're a lot of the way there. Now let's add a hi-hat. We're back to the default. And we're gonna turn our noise on again, and we're gonna turn this oscillator off. And same thing. Okay, turn your sustain down. You're going to need a much shorter decay and release this time. So that'd be a closed hi-hat right there. Uh, since Viking is monophonic, then you can actually do a sustain and kind of treat it as your open hi-hat. Um, so I'll leave that up to you right now. Um, you can play with that. I'm just going to do closed hi-hats only. And then we are going to change the filter mode here from, from dual low pass to high pass low pass. Because we it's hi hats, so we want to hear the high end. And then we're going to record with that. So let's see how that sounds.
And there we go. There's a simple kit, kick, snare, hi-hat made just from the Viking VK1 pay what you want synthesizer from Blamsoft. In the next tutorial, we will make this monophonic instrument play chords, which is pretty easy to do actually. So thanks for watching.